Residents of Ho Kung and Hui An villages in Chia To Khomi Nepo district turned their lights on with electricity from the national grid for the first time at the end of 2022. Since then, their lives have gradually improved with access to electricity, equipment and appliances, and the internet, which are all essentials for improving livelihoods. We long sought electricity for daily use and production. We don't want our kids to study in darkness. I have now bought a TV and a rice cooker. Some friends of mine bought refrigerators. When established in 2013, Nampo district has only 8 out of its 15 communes covered by the national grid. All are now covered, contributing greatly to the locality's socio-economic development and poverty reduction. Similar to Nampo district, Điện Biên Đông is among the most difficult localities in Điện Biên province and in Vietnam as a whole. It has invested some $3.5 million in connecting its remote villages to the national grid. We aim to cooperate with relevant authorities and agencies from now until the end of 2025, to connect remote villages that currently lack access to the national grid. We recognize that access will improve their lives greatly. We hope that relevant authorities and organizations in Dien Bien province will work with us in expanding the national grid to the province's remote areas. Local socio-economic development will be improved as a result. The Bien province has been carrying out its rural electricity supply project for the 2021-2025 period, which targets providing electricity to 9,000 households in eight remote districts.